Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can renew self-signed certificates of vCenter Server in vCenter Server Appliance 6.7 using Certificate Management GUI tool which is available when you log into vCenter Server. Using this tool for certificate management, you can renew or replace with custom certificate either from a public CA or from an Active Directory CA. But I'll be renewing self-signed certificates using the VMware CA, also called as VMCA, which is an internal CA that runs on vCenter server, both in appliance-based and Windows-based. Now, if you're running vCenter server 6.5 or prior, including the Windows vCenter server of any version, then you need to use the command line tool. Here is the VMware KB article which talks about how to regenerate certificates using VMware Certificate Authority which is included in all vSphere 6.x version. Okay, so let me jump into the demo. Now this tool is not going to work in the Adobe Flash client. You need to be using the HTML5 client. So I'm going to click on launch vSphere client HTML5. To renew the certificate, you need to log in as uh, SSO admin. So I'm going to use the default SSO administrator credentials, which is administrator at vSphere.local. And then I'm going to type in the password, click login. All right, so let me give a quick tour of our vCenter server environment. So I'm going to open up hosts and clusters. And in hosts and clusters, I have a very simple environment a single HA cluster and I have a VCSA which is running in VCHA mode. Now this procedure to renew the certificate would be similar for any standalone VCSA as well. So first thing what we have to do is we have to go into menu and navigate to administration. Okay, so here it is certificate management. This is the new GUI tool starting from vCenter server 6.7. So I'm going to click on that. Now you need to enter the credentials of the vCenter server to manage the certificates. So you can either type the server IP or the FQDN. So I'm going to type the FQDN of the vCenter server, vcsa.contoso.local. And again, you need to use a SSO admin account. So I'm going to use the default admin account, which is administrator at vSphere.local. And I'm going to type the password and click on login and manage certificates. So here is the new GUI tool which I was talking about. So it will show you all the certificates which are assigned to this vCenter server. So starting from you can see the machine certificate and all the solution certificates, including the root certificate. And for each certificate, it will show the expiry date. And if you click on view details, you can see the certificate information as well as the issuer information. Now, back to certificate management, let's just say I want to renew a certificate which is going to expire in another few days, right? So all that I have to do is I just have to click on action, okay, and click on renew. So it says new certificate will be issued using currently configured VMCA root certificate. So I'm going to click on renew and that's it. It says success certificate renewed. If you want to renew all solution certificates, you simply click on renew all and click on renew all and it's going to renew all the solution certificates. Otherwise, you can simply renew a specific certificate which is going to expire. And if you want to replace a certificate with a custom certificate, let's say from a public CA or from an active directory CA, you simply click on replace and follow the procedure to replace the certificate. And if you want to create a certificate signing request, you simply click on generate certificate signing request. I hope this video has been helpful to you and I thank you for watching this video.